In Vietnam, his image is everywhere. Revered as the father of the nation, Ho Chi Minh is a symbolic figure in the struggle against colonialism and an icon of communism. But now a new book claims that his real story has been suppressed. According to Jian Tu Hyung, the most famous critic of Vietnam's communist regime, when Ho Chi Minh was in his 60s, he had an affair with a woman some 40 years his junior who bore him two children. The romance, says Jung, was cut from history books because it might tarnish the image of the father of the nation. The father of the people has to have dedicated his life, his time and his energy to the people, not to a woman of flesh and blood. The claims are made in Jung's new novel, which she says is based on 15 years of research. It suggests that four years after Ho Chi Minh began his liaison, the party had the woman assassinated. She was clubbed to death with a blow to the head. Afterwards, they threw the body on the road to make it look like a traffic accident. Ho Chi Minh carried this secret to the grave, dying in September 1969, on the anniversary of Vietnamese independence. According to Jung, he pulled out the medical drip himself, choosing to die on that symbolic day in a final act of defiance against the party. Now, Jung wants the Vietnamese people to know about it. The people must understand. They have been manipulated. They have been humiliated. Jung Tu Hyung can never return to her home country. And though you won't find her novel in any Hanoi bookshops, it is available on the internet. For those Vietnamese who read it, Uncle Ho will never seem the same again.